them, you know, are like, hey, I need a little bit of help. Like, I'm a little lost. What's, mm-hmm. like, your advice to a guy who's whatever? He could be coming out of university or in his 30s, but he's, like, looking for a little direction. How do you, how do you start off, get centered to become successful, you know, get money, get bitches? Like, how, what would you tell them? That's a, I can answer that question in so many different ways. Mm-hmm. There's, like, ten different answers I can give. But I think, truthfully, in the world we're living in now, I use this analogy a lot. Maybe I overuse it but you need to find a way to some degree to escape the matrix. Mm. And I, and I say the matrix because the matrix, the way it is designed. And you're now, not just talking shit because you've actually done that. <laughs> I've escaped the matrix. Yeah. I've literally escaped the matrix in nearly every form. So any form of oppression no longer applies to me. I'm uncounseled. I can't be canceled. You know, I can say what I want. My finances are secure. I've escaped the matrix. And when I talk about the matrix, it primarily applies to men because men are the backbone of the slave force. We always have been and always will be. And unfortunately now, if you're a law-abiding man inside the matrix, your future and the life that is laid out for you is nothing but depressing. You're going to go to school. You're going to get in debt. You're going to get a job. You're going to get a wife. Divorce is coming. You're going to lose the house eventually. Your job's shit. Inflation's outpacing your wages. You're going to work, work, work. No one's going to appreciate it. Now you're old and your life's over. That is the matrix for 99% of men. And you need to find a way to escape it. And I guess I was kind of fortunate from a young age that I always knew that the matrix was coming and that the system is designed to oppress the people who make the rules do not make the rules for the benefit of us. They make the rules for the benefit of the people who make the rules. And I knew that. And I think every person intrinsically knows that. Like if it's four in the morning and you're sitting in a gas station and a Lambo pulls up, you're probably thinking drug dealer or criminal. You're not thinking, oh, he definitely went to school. Yeah. No, yeah. no so everyone true. knows this, right? That's true. So you have to find a way to escape the matrix to some degree. Oh, wait, let me stop. 